Police involved shooting in northwest Baltimore tonight. Amy Yancey is on the scene and has the very latest for us. Amy. Well, Mary, I can tell you that no officers were injured in this police involved shooting. We're told that there will be a briefing any minute now. We've been waiting for just about two hours to get the latest details from police. But let me just show you the scene here on Gwyn's Falls Parkway. As you can see, there is a crime scene tape that is up and it's blocking about two blocks in this area. We're near Garrison Boulevard. Uh, TJ Smith, which is a police spokesman, tweeted about the shooting um, at 8.52 uh, this evening. And there has been a heavy presence ever since. I can also tell you that uh, the new police commissioner, Daryl D'Souza, is on scene and he has been talking to investigators. There are also lots of uh, crime scene uh, evidence markers on scene and there's also a man, a police officer, checking with a metal detector looking for evidence. Now, this is the second police involved shooting in Baltimore City in just over a week. The suspect in the uh, officer involved shooting on January 20th will uh, not suffer any life threatening injuries, but we don't know what happened in this case, and we're waiting for that briefing, which we're told will happen at any minute. So if it happens during this newscast, we will bring it to you live. But that's the latest from here in Northwest Baltimore. I'm Amy Yancey reporting for WJZ. Back to you. All right, Amy, thank you so much. And WJZ will continue to follow this developing story. Look for updates on our website throughout the night.